Greetings everybody, this is Jester, welcoming you to Kobali Prime. And today we will be reviewing the Delta Alliance Combat Armour. It looks the part, doesn't it? I have a good feeling about this armour. Um, yeah, it doesn't have a helmet, or I couldn't find one, but... I'm not particularly bothered. I think it looks quite good. And I do like the look of this weapon as well, which comes with the armor. Uh, it is part of a three-piece set. And I've brought two of my crewmates down with me in some different colors. So you get a rough idea of what you can do with this armor. And I think it's... Um, I think it looks quite good, actually. And I also like the weapon. I think the weapon looks different. Let's hope it doesn't let us down when we go into the field. So very quickly, let's look at the stats. So the stats for this armor. It is plus 64 physical damage and kinetic damage resistance rating. And energy damage resistance rating. Resistance rating rather. 70.1 maximum hit points 38.4 root resistance hold resistance rating and not back resistance rating reduces all energy damage to shields by 20% part of part of set delta lines 3 of 3 so we have we have all the three pieces to this kit we have the delta alliance unimatrix personal shield and that gives us 386.4 maximum shield capacity as a health of 801 at 801 I can't you know I'm gonna have to get some glasses 811 so that's teeth and glasses my word regeneration rate 158 percent minimum shields 394 Run speed 13.65, critical chance 10.5, critical severity 58.0. So going back to the shield, it's a 386.4 maximum shield capacity, 10% bleed through, rapidly regenerates after not taking damage for 3 seconds, 50% shield drain resistance, when attacking 5% chance, 5% shield hardness for 30 seconds can stack 3 times and the weapon it is an anti-proton weapon 42.3 anti-proton damage times 4 125.4 dps when attacking 5% chance plus 5% shield hardness for 30 seconds can stack 3 times hmm 40% critical severity 2% critical chance oh. Uh, chances to not back. Do you know? I quite like the look of that. Um, anyway, my backup weapon. I'm going with the Lucari piezoelectric wrist apparatus. Well, that wasn't easy to say, was it? But I'm going to go with that anyway because I quite like the uh, uh, the effect it does. Um, kits, because as you know. It's always important with ground weapons to have some decent kits behind you. I'm sticking with the Herald Engineering Kit. 31.9 weapon proficiency, 95.6 kit performance, 31.9 endurance training and 20% phaser weapon damage. Unfortunately, we don't, we're don't. we not using a phaser, we're using an anti-proton weapon, but uh, yes. Anyway, moving on. Uh, Ravager Barrage. Cloaked Mine Barrier, Cyclonic Generator, oops, there's this, keep doing that, don't I? Um, Scarab Plating, Massive Damage Resistance, Shield Regeneration, plus 598.9 Shield Generation over 15 seconds, plus 300 All Damage Resistance Rating for 15 seconds. Hmm. And finally, the Chronoton Mine Barrier. Quite like these mines, as you can as you can guess. Um, the Parvin Healing Crystal, gambling device, 
gonna, we're going to take three hypos with us, and we're going to take our dino with us. Okay, so let's. Uh, Oops, there's this. Let's uh, get the gambling device uh, out of the way first. Well, that's not good news, is it? So, uh, yeah, looks like we're going to have a world of pain with that. If you wanted to know what that is, by the way, uh, if we lose, we're going to be minus 10 critical chance and minus 10 critical severity, minus 15 dodge. Uh, and that's going to last for one minute. If we'd have done it the other way and got good luck, it would have lasted for an hour. It would have gone the other way. So, um, never mind. It's only for a minute. We'll have another go again in the field and see what happens. So, I've got a good feeling about this. So, without further ado, let's go and have a look, see what we can shoot. Now, then, what am I going to do here? I was going to do something here. That's right, I was going to wish you a hypo, wasn't I? So, where are we? Here we are, small hypo. So we'll pop that in there. Right. Come on, gang. Let's go shoot some vodwa. Where are they? Come on, guys. Keep up, for goodness sake. Got to get your fitness sorted out. You're still there? Yeah, come on. Holy moly. We are all day at this rate. And, oh, now we're rubber banding. My word. Where are we? Are they still there? Yeah. Come on, guys. Right, let's see if we can go another way. I always run across the bridge, don't I? So I'll try and, let's try and get a bit wet. I hope you guys don't mind. We're going to get wet. They didn't like that then, did they? Did you see them? They froze a little bit there, but no man. Here we go. Come on, let, let the professionals in. Oh, this weapon looks... Uh, oh, quite like this weapon. It's highly unusual to get a weapon and a, an armour that actually... Uh, oh. Oh, Yeah, well then. Ooh. Who's doing that? Oh, it's this guy. Ooh, yeah, that uh, that's smarted a bit, isn't it? Right, so let's move on. What I also aim to do in this session is, uh, as always, I'm sure you're aware by now, I do like to have a bit of a, a melee match with some uh, weapons and swords, so we'll have a bit of a go at that. Viking damage detected. We're shooting at it out this one. Let's get out from under this so I can see what we're doing. Right, so oops, right, come on. Where are you? Come on guys. to keep them on the toes, haven't we, these? There's more players there, so we've got to be careful we don't want to get involved with other players. Oh, not bad, we're in sight, is there? Let's, let's... So, oh, here we are, look, plenty of hardware here. Enemy targets on power. Let's Lightning give them some good detected. news. Right, I think we will... Should we? Yeah, let's... Let's let's do a bit of uh, melee. Right, let's get the old sword out. Show these Vaudois what we're made of. Where are you? Where have men gone? Come on guys, keep up. Oh well, leave them to it. Right, let's let's get up here. Just 
Just can't get the stuff, can you? Can't get the stuff. I think we've been that way. Let's go up here. Ah, here we are. Hello, crazy Vadwa. Thank you, Doctor. Here's our my... Oh, call... oh, they're here. Oh, they're here. Well, finally. Where have you been? Dear me. We've taken on the whole Vodwa by ourselves. Right, let's... Well, we're going to get shot here. Deal with this one, right? So, okay. Uh, I think I don't mind going back to normal weapon for now. Right, let's have a go with this uh, carry weapon. I do quite like this. It's got a really good effect, actually. It does it does remind me of the of uh, Star Wars? Enemy targets on center. Tell you what, if I could get a Star Wars hood, it would pass as the Emperor, wouldn't it? This, uh... Yeah, I am your father. Oh no, the Emperor didn't say that, did he? That was Darth Vader. Yeah, I got me Emperors and Vaders mixed up there, didn't I? Anyway, never mind. Right, here we go. Let's give these guys the good news. I, I do like this carry weapon, it certainly uh, has a good effect. Excellent, right. Oh, here we are, another four. Let's give these the good news. Yeah, as you know, I've given up on the melee weapon. <laughs> The, the, the bad one, the Tholians, just move too fast. Yeah, I think the Borg are a lot better, they just stand there and get slaughtered. I mean, Vadwar and the Tholians tend to move around a little bit. I mean, I don't understand why. You'd think they'd just want to stand around and let me slaughter them, wouldn't you? Um, anyhow. Sure, I saw some down there. Yeah, here we are. Ooh, sneaky. It's, uh... Oh, there we go. Oh, no way. Where this lot come from? Yeah, there you go. Oh God, they're all over the place now. Where were you nearly half an hour ago? Not exactly half an hour, but when we first started, anyway. Yeah. Yeah, I could do a bit of Star Wars theme there, wouldn't I? Oh. Got the Emperor's electrical. Uh, Thing go in there, don't we? So, uh, I think if we find him a, a cape, I think we'd pass him off as a Star Wars character as well with this electrical lightning that he's got. There we go. Different colour though, isn't it? Starting off purple and white. That's different colour. Another odd one there. I'll, oh, you can, oh dear. Sneaky. There we go, there we go, that's, that's what we 
I needed. Where's Yodler gone? What's happened to Yodler? Oh, I've lost one. Where's Yodler? Oh, there he is, look. He's just lying around his Yodler, so we'll just rescue Yodler and then we'll head on back. Well done there, Cole. As I saw you do your little back kick thing then, that was quite cool. Come on, Yodler, hope you get. Right, there we go. We don't leave anybody behind. <coughs> Just finish off with the proper weapon as we're moving along. Just in case we run into any pesky Vadois. There's a couple here, look, entrenched. Let's uh, On there, guys, we did one there. We rooted out the nest. Yes, carry on. You're doing very well. We've broke the back for you. You can just pull. Anyways, off. Right. Okay. Enemy hold your fire. Hold your fire. Oh, who's firing? Just hold on a minute. We were running away then. Well, you know, it's a gentlemanly thing. So let us retreat. Hold your fire, gentlemen. Oh, I said, hold your fire. I was coming through then. Right, here we go. Honestly. So keen. Right. Right, so. Well, that's an interesting session, wasn't it? Right. So, this is the Delta Alliance Combat Armor. Um, I. I know it had once, but um, I, I I quite like it. It uh, I like the look of the weapon. I think if we upgrade that weapon, it's going to be a pretty good weapon to use. Actually, it's very rare that you get a, a decent symbiosis between the combat suit and the weapon as well. You know, most of the suits I've reviewed have pretty poor weapons that go with the set, but this one, you know, it seems did he just appear out of nowhere then? Really? That's what I don't know. It's quite unnerving, isn't it? With people just appear out of thin air. Uh, thank you. Anyway, so I hope you've liked this review. We'll be pulling together these reviews shortly. I'll be doing a top 15 of the armor um, reviews that we've put together just to give you a personal idea of uh, what I like and. Uh, how easy it is to acquire the armor as well. Anyhow, hope you've liked this review. Um, please like, subscribe for future for future reviews, and uh, I hope to see you out there. So in the meantime, this is Jester signing off. <laughs>